school science technician. It's not all glamour. Today, I will be washing these safety glasses and then drying them. It's an end of year task that needs doing for all the labs, nine labs. Um, and I've done, just consulted my board. I've done four now. I did push, wash them all already once and then I left them to dry naturally and then they had marks all over them, you couldn't see through them. So now I'm doing them again. But these ones haven't been through the dishwasher yet. So these are dirty, very dirty. So I'm gonna stick them in the dishwasher and then in an hour and 21 minutes, I will take them out of the dishwasher and dry them. It's so much fun. We will wash you. Oh no, look, this one's armless. Can't hurt anyone. Oh, oh, oh. We will wash you. And the mice and the mouse organ. This is dishwasher POV. Do people say POV or do they just say point of view? Or do they even say POV? I'm pretty sure they don't say POV. I'm going to put this one in anyway because I might be able to find an arm. There you go. Now they're out of the dishwasher, so now I have wet glasses, box to put dry glasses in, tea towels. It's just, yeah, very exciting. A set of 30 for each classroom, and probably that will last about one practical, because the kids never put them back in the slots, they just chuck them in. It's like the laptop trolley all over again. I don't ever reset these, only once a year. Board ready. I feel like these have warped in the dishwasher. Or maybe they were warped already. I'm not sure anyone's got a head this shape. I must remember to do the safety goggles. These are safety spectacles, so they uh, offer less protection than safety goggles, which like go around the sides as well. So that if like you've got chemicals that might splash and get in your eyes, like copper sulfate, you need splash-proof goggles. So a lot of people call these goggles, but they're not. They're safety spectacles. It's 25 degrees in here today. 25. That's too much. Quite a lot of glasses missing from this set. Restocked. Dun, 